What's up guys? In this tutorial, I will show you how to find your or someone else's Steam ID, the games they play, their playing time, and all the other information related to their Steam profile. First, open a Steam client on your PC and log into your account. Locate the user whose information you want to find. You can do this by using the search bar at the top right corner of the Steam window. Enter the username of the person you're looking for and select their profile from the search results. Once you're on their profile page, click on the link at the top of the page to copy it to your clipboard. This link will be useful later on when you need to input it to a third-party site to gather more information. If you're unable to get a user's Steam ID directly from their profile, you can use a site like steamidfinder.com. Navigate to this page and enter their username or paste the account link you copied earlier. This site will provide you with the user's Steam ID and other useful information. For more detailed information, steamdb.com is a better option. Head to steamdb and navigate to the calculator section. Here you can enter the username or Steam ID, set the currency to whatever you prefer and click calculate. The site will take a second to process the information. After calculating, steamdb will display various details about the account including account value, average price per game, hours on record, average playtime per game. Below this, you'll find additional details such as account ID, Steam ID, any game bans, for example VAC bans, money spent on unplayed games if the information is public. If you're looking to copy their profile customizations, such as the background, avatar frame or even the Steam Deck keyboard skin, scroll down to their profile page in SteamDB. Click on each item to locate them in the Steam Store, where you can purchase the same customizations for your profile. Some information may not be available if the user's account settings are set to private. I hope this helped you out. Leave a comment if you have any questions and see you in the next one.